Greetings and salutations, I'm Kev. Welcome to this new Let's Play of Crusader Kings 2. Now, I've not really played this game since the release of the Old Gods expansion, so I'm incredibly incredibly rusty, and I've never been particularly good at this game anyway, so don't expect any stellar plays. But, um, well, to me, this game has never really been about empire building anyway. It has been more about the, um, the story, basically. The um, story of your dynasty and everything that can happen and all the little events. So, yeah, we're probably not going to be building a massive empire, and it might also be a very short game, because I'm going to start in the earliest bookmark, and I'm just going to pick a random character. Now, I'll immediately say this, I've not really played outside the Catholic and Norse faiths, that's pretty much all I've played over here. So if we end up somewhere else, like in deep Russia or India or in the Muslim world, somewhere there like that, that's going to be a new game for me, so, um, yeah. Um, I might have to sit and read quite a few of the little bits and pieces to learn how to play. So expect a fair few... Uh, expect a slow game. Um, and beyond that, uh, you've probably also noticed by now, the interface is incredibly bloated. And that's because I have to play this game on a very low screen resolution in order to be able to read all the text. Because the font size in this game is tiny! So, yeah. I can't really play this at 1920 by 1280 if I did that, I could not possibly read any of the interface bits. So, yeah. Random character. We're gonna play over in India, apparently. Uh, and we're gonna... Oh, my. Okay, I think we actually have a fair amount of power. That was unexpected. I was really pretty much expecting to get a count somewhere, but it looks like we're gonna start in a slightly greater position. In we go. We're gonna go with uh, basic rules. Uh, Iron Man enabled. And uh, let's go. Bengal. So we are apparently already start as a king. Sounds lovely. Uh, we are playing as a Bengali Buddhist Maharaja. Ah, okay, Buddhism. Let's see, that's completely new to me. We're still feudal. Thank goodness for that, at least. Um, Buddhism was founded by Buddha and Siddhartha Gautama in northern India in the 5th century BC. The religion flourished in India for more than 1500 years, building large libraries and... Uh, monastery complexes until Muslim invasions and the growing power of the Brahmin caste drove Buddhism out of the subcontinent. In the game, Buddhism gets a significant bonus to learning, meaning that they will research technologies faster. I like this. I like tech. Let's see. Women will own temple holdings. No opinion penalty against female rulers. Ooh, that's cool. Uh, we might take up to three concubines. Can designate any valid offspring as their heir. Ooh, I like this. I really like this. Uh, there is a. Um, there is and can exist no religious head. Fair enough. Can only declare limited holy wars against non Indian religions. Well then. First of all, let's see. Uh, behold our realm. Um, which of them is us? <laughs> okay, this one's us. This is all we rule, Pala. Yeah. The Pala Kingdom, Kingdom of Bengal. And we have quite a few... Um, that aren't I mean, are direct holdings, are they? Sweet Jesus! Do we hold our entire freakish realm? And two kingdoms? What? My goodness. Uh, let's see, see if I can um, sort this mess out. Uh, <laughs> need to figure out just how powerful we are. I mean, we had vassals, but... Uh, uh, how do I even see that? How do I see my... There must be a view to see exactly what I hold. There we go. So we hold, let's see, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9 counties. Which is actually more than we can hold. Yikes. This is quite a bit better than I expected from a random, <laughs> random character. But I'll take it. It might not be Charlemagne, but my goodness. Um, 9 counties, yeah, and 2 kingdom titles. Uh, can I even see... Let's see. Um, I need to see De Jour stuffs. I can even... Ah. 
this and no du jour. Where's the du jour button? Uh, there's the there it is. Never mind. Um. The Raj. Yeah, I have to try, try. I have to just get into the, what the heck these things are named. So, uh, Thikana, that's county. Raj is the duchy. Uh, and then we have the kingdoms on top of that. And finally, the Bengal Empire, which is probably what we're going to aim for now. Uh, oh my goodness! Interesting. We're getting close to it, actually. <laughs> Control 17 of... Yeah, that's fine. Silk Road. Which is also something I've not played with. So, we have that to enjoy. Our main holding is actually on the Silk Road. Um, does that mean we can build anything fancy? The war elephant pens. <laughs> uh. Well, at any rate, we start as a king. Uh, apparently, a double king, a double Maharaja. Um, wish I could see these du jour. That's one du jour. And we hold the Pala kingdom as well, which is quite significant. But not, we don't actually hold all of that, so... So, let's see. This, for example, is part, right? So, I s assume I have a... Uh, de jour claim. Yeah, there we go. Interesting. Lots of de jours. There are... Oh, I like how all of these are uh, split up. We might take advantage of that. If we have any power. <laughs> I don't know. Um, let's see. Yeah, well, we'll just have to get things sorted. And one thing at a time here. Uh, three titles can be created. Quite a few duchies. Uh, we can only hold two duchy titles, if I recall correctly. So, and we hold all two rajas. Do I'm not all that inclined to do that. Uh, we hold this Raj. Three province Raj. And we hold this Raj. Well, this is going to be our primary Raj, definitely. Um, we also have some Jujur land over there. Well, how big is that? I mean, we want the biggest, richest duchies, right? That's a lot of holdings. Four holdings. Ah, uh, you, sir. The Bika of Gaia. Okay, uh, are you not a count? Oh, okay, so that's a temple holding. Fair enough. Ooh, face paint. Yeah, we'll sort this thing out eventually. Um, yeah, we're not going to create uh, the duchy of... It's a three-province duchy down there. We hold one of the provinces. We have to give away the other one. I'm not sure I want to create a... Uh, too strong a... area just yet. We don't hold those two, so I don't... I don't really want to push that one. And finally, it was this one where we hold two. I'm going to hold off on creating those titles, at least. Um, we need to get married. I agree. Let's see if we can find someone good. What are our traits? We are... Well, we're good on learning, I suppose. We're not that good on other things. But since we are in such a good position for uh, conquesty things, you might want to look around for someone who's militant, like you, miss. Uh, you are Buddhist, right? Yes, you're Buddhist. Um, you hold claims to the... Ooh, you hold claims. These titles, Luntai. 
Uh, could I even see what the heck those are? Let's see. Uh, uh, titles to We claim on the Duchy of... Yeah, we're probably not going to be able to conquer, st or conquer our way up there. And then what about the other one? Uh, that was you, right? Um, that's even further north. Never mind. Okay, we're not going to get any benefit from those the claims. Uh, so I think we're just going to go for uh, military. Uh, we Our heir is our brother, I think. Yeah, okay, so we need children. Uh, we are... 16. Okay, we're quite young. So we'd kind of like to have a young uh, spouse. Uh, what sort of... Oh, there's a branch of the Buddhism as well. Um... Mahayana branch, and apparently we're also in caste. Because we are in India. Um, 21, you're not that old. She follows another uh, faith, though. Plus one learning opposite trait opinion, so I assume you don't like me because I'm opposite, yeah. Uh, you and the other don't care. Still, well, she would balance out, let's see now, she would balance out our weakness in diplomacy. I almost wish there was like a total number on the end there so I could see exactly how many, how many pips, so to speak, they have. Um, in total points, 9 plus 10 plus 9 plus 14. So that's uh, 42. And here we have uh, 24, 34, 37, 40. So she has more stats in total. And I think it's going to be one of these two. Unless there is someone absolutely brilliant down here. There might be. Do we have any geniuses? No, we do have someone attractive, but she's only four years old. I think <laughs> we're not going to go for that. Um, that would take too long. That would take too long. No, it's going to have to be one of these two. Um... Can can female rulers lead in the this faith? I wonder. We're actually quite a good uh, ourselves, brilliant strategist. Um, ah, let's go with the warmongering. You miss. And would that create anything? Uh, Non-aggression pack, that's fine. So let's get ourselves married. Uh, the mess is too big, yes, I know, we're gonna deal with that in a second. Uh, ambition. Well, we are pretty much on top of the world. Uh, don't reject the poison of greed. Ooh. Interesting. Uh, see the realm prosper. If the realm is attacked or he goes to war, this ambition will fail. Okay, so we're not going to go for that. Well, the war chest sounds lovely. Uh, Groom and air. We don't really have one, so yeah. Um, let's see, we're ruling... Are we actually an empire title? Oh, it is kingdom, right? We're ruling two twin kingdoms. So we need to amass how much? 700 gold. How much are we gaining? 17. So that would take us, let's see, monthly, 17. Ah, mathematics. I hate mathematics. Um, say we make 100 every five months. So it wouldn't it'd take like, yeah, a year or two. A year, year, year and a few months to get to that goal, unless we pay on for something, which we'll undoubtedly do. Um, and we get an increased tax modifier for a couple of years. Wait a second, is that... Well, that's a success effect, yeah, so that's after we actually succeed in saving up money. And we get more base, more tax income. Which is nice. 
But I'm fairly certain we're going to be a bit warmongerish. Perhaps we don't want to... Perhaps we want to switch away our traits. I don't know how this actually... Wait a minute. Karma. I assume karma is the same thing as... Uh, yeah, there we go. Instead of piety, we have karma. I think. Let's see. Looks like it. Fair enough. Um, I want to see if we can do this. So do you want to be less prideful or do we want to be less... Uh, uh, greedy? I mean, I like the extra tax money. <laughs> Not gonna lie. And the prestige is also nice. Um... Eeny, meeny, miny, moe. Um... Well, let's try to try to remove the pride first. I mean, I like the treaty actually, but yeah, that's fine. Uh, the, the other things we can press quite a few claims. That's fine. Um, character focus. I am fairly certain we're gonna be militant like Galore here. So then again, we kind of want to make sure that we don't die because we don't really have an heir. Our only heir is our brother. So we do have an heir. It's not going to be over. We're going to be ruling as our brother if we, we're not careful. Um, and he looks to be a warmonger too. I wouldn't lose any titles, right? No. Yes, actually that. Uh, d -d 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 um, laws. We are Agnatic Gavelkend. Wait, I thought it... it I thought it said I could like appoint. Oh, I can appoint my heir, but I'm still. Uh... Hmm. Still very much a gavelkind. Primogeniture will require more checks, right? Yeah. And I do want to pass that law. Uh, do we have an... Are we actually absolute right now? Council, we do not have... Any council power. Oh, yes. We are definitely going to go there. Um, though if we do that, that's gonna that's a vassal limit. Not the Mesni. So, we're going to go... Embrace that. It's going to increase our vassal limit. Or the Mesni limit by one. It should. Seven of eight, yeah, that's fine. Or still the way around. Nine of eight holds held, but we're gonna be married too, so that might change. That. You know what? We're gonna wait a little bit with our focus. I want to see how much our uh, stewardship stats change once we're married. Um. We're gonna set our crown focus on our. Capital, I think. Uh, let's see, only one county, maybe. Yeah, that's fine. Set crown focus for. How do I choose? Oh, yeah, uh, use. Yeah, that, that's how I choose. Let's see. Da -da -da. That's the one we wanted to set crown focus for, but this is kind of confusing. It doesn't change where we roam here. Uh, can I, like, go here? That's the Raj. Not what I want after. I'm after this particular one. Uh, so if I right-click here... No, that's not it. Do I actually have to go through that interface every single time? That's going to be annoying. Um, not what I want to do. There must be a crown focus button here somewhere. Current capital, uh, make crown. That there we go. Make crown focus. Uh, 
Yep, make ground focus for our capital. Um, there we go. So the Silk Road thing. Trade posts built in the Silk Road counties increase. That's fine. Trade posts. So how do I build a trade post? Let's see now. That's our primary holding, our county capital. Uh, there's nothing like that in this. That's the Vicara. I assume that's the temple holdings. That's the city. Uh, wait, Dama. Okay, so a Dama is the same as a noble. Yeah, a port. Fair enough. Da -da. So two cities. Uh, okay, fair enough. As for building things, castle, city, temple, that's not what we're, all, what we're after. I'm sure there's a button somewhere. <laughs> we'll figure it out at some point, I guess. Uh, so I, don't, I don't know how this is done. The Silk Road thing. But I appreciate that at least. Yeah. Mm. Maybe this one? Extended. Uh, oh, there we go, trade post. So, is this for the county? Do they take up a holding slot? They don't, do they? We can build a hospital. And we can build a trade post. Uh, along the... Da -da 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 -da. Any local ruler is also allowed to build trade posts if they're in their counties if the Silk Road happens to pass through. Um... Wait a second. So let's have a look here. Uh, I didn't have... Let's see if we can find the trade thing. Again, this is something new to me, so... I'm gonna be messing around and trying to understand this. Ah, that's why. I was wondering why the, the, this had the Silk Road, but not this one over here. Now I see why. The Silk Road goes out here through this. And through here. Uh, potential trade post. We do not hold those two provinces. We can't build trade posts there. Um... Potential trade post. We can... Wait a second. So, we control this one, right? But we cannot build a trade post there. Why not? Can only build trade just in certain counties. Okay, fair enough. So not all counties, but certain counties. So we can build a trade post in two of our counties, which we are gonna do. Just for funsies. One over there. And... Oh, I can't build one here? It's not over... Ooh, I did not see the limit. Can I cancel this now? Ah. Well, darn it. That was not my intent. I wanted to build it in, in the more prosperous area. But, ah, well. Done is done. What is done is done. Uh, yeah, character focus. I wanted to wait, wait for a second with that. And... Special minor, minor titles, regent and court position. Did we recruit a court position already? No. No, let's do that. Let's see if something happens. And I will unpause for a second just to get our marriage and everything like that in order. Uh, you agree? Okay. Um... Do I want the money or do I want the prestige? My goodness, we start with 2,000 prestige. I like this. Um, in that case, we want the money. Oh yeah, we're actually in the Far East, aren't we? So, what about you, India? You like Altai cultures and you dislike Byzantine cultures. You are... Uh, China is open and in unrest. Uh, what can we do to carry favors? Pay tribute. 
Do we want to? I mean, we li live in the shadow of them. I don't know. Let's see now. Grace, right. Now, uh, how does this work? Uh, Grace is paying tribute. Can be accumulate Grace to ask for a boon. What sort of boon? What can we ask for? I like this idea of getting a non-aggression pack with these guys. Um. How much is tribute? Doesn't specify. So no, let's click the button and see what happens. Okay, fair enough. Um, become a tributary. Pledge your allegiance. Don't really want to do that. Kowtow before the Emperor. <laughs> we can travel to them and bow before. Well, um, interesting. And the concubine. Okay. Um, we <laughs> only have one choice. The Queen Mother. Uh, I don't think I want to send Mom over to be a courtier or a uh, concubine. I don't think. I don't think dear old Mom would appreciate that. Yeah, we're gonna. Uh, we're gonna wait and see what happens there. Um, hopefully they won't. Do, uh, hopefully they won't become mean against us. Mean towards us. Well, uh, we'd not gain much more stewardship. We're gonna hold one Debesni over our limit right now. Um, one, yeah, one holding over our limit. Do our vassals object to this? He's content. He's quite happy. Most of our vassals are actually quite content. We only have a few that are not. Our steward is kind of crump grumpy. Uh, as is our chancellor, as is our spy master. Married wrong cast. I didn't think about that at all. Uh, she's... Oh. Oh, dear. I forgot about the cast system. So marrying out of cast. She doesn't have any cast, apparently. And that's gonna cost quite a few. Oh, dear. They're very cross about that. But only those three. Why not the rest? Oh, because these guys are... Uh, Hindi, right? Yeah, that's it. So, we have that little problem. The Hindi folks are going to be much more cross about such things. Which is kind of funny, because our entire realm is actually uh, Buddhist. But some of the rulers are Hindi. Can't have that. Can't have that. We'll have to see if we can convert these guys into the proper faith. Regardless, it is time for a break, I think. And we'll see if we can get this adventure going. Um, this was a bit more of an overwhelming start than I expected, to be honest. I really had to expect it to start as a county somewhere. But hey, I'll take this. <laughs> Thank you for watching.